In this video I will show you how to use the case annotations or the noter up. Judastat calls it the case annotations, LexisNexis calls it the noter up, but they do the same work. You use this index to establish if a particular case is still good authority. Put in another way, it's if you've found a particular case and you want to see how it has been treated in subsequent cases. Let's start with Judastat. Now once again go down to the law reports, open those up. There we find the case annotations. If you open that up, find the particular court case you need to search according to the case name so here you can see this can be quite tedious to have to scroll down through this whole list until you find the particular case that you are looking for I'll just click on any one of these to show you what the idea behind it is if you then if you if that's the decision that you found there's the judgment and you want to know how this particular judgment has been treated subsequently in further cases you can then see that that 2014 volume 3 decision was later qualified by a constitutional court decision so if you now read this initial judgment you need to take note that it was subsequently qualified in other words it's not given uh, unqualified support there was some issue that the constitutional court identified that had to be um, taken note of all right another way of finding the the, uh, the annotations let me quickly show you that let's take that example from your first year again the pension case so here I'm here I have the actual decision Right, and then here you see in the in the heading where all you find all the technical information there is a shortcut that says link to case annotations if you click on this hyperlink it takes you straight to the annotations of for that specific judgment so instead of having to search under P until you finally get to pension you can follow this shortcut here you can see quite a range of judgments since the 1963 decision there's been a whole range of references to this particular judgment it was confirmed on appeal referred to in a 1965 case applied in a 1966 case it was distinguished on some grounds in the 1981 decision so you would have to take note of that one and so on until you finally get to a 2005 decision where, it, where this case was discussed and applied and then a few years after that distinguished by the ACA again so you now want to know if the pension case is still good authority you would at the very least have to take note of this 2008 decision of the ACA where in the fly notes again you can confirm this judgment has similarities with the pension case and that the original pension case should now be read with this Stewart case if we then go to the LexisNexis version and again the law reports remember again this is uh, indexed to the all South African law report so it's it, the citations will differ we open the consolidated indexes again here you see remember the LexisNexis version it's called the noter up but it does the same work as the consolidated index uh, sorry the same work as the case annotations in the Judastat version we'll follow the New South African cases. Let's do P again for pension. In the 
this version you will see that all the cases are listed so it's a bit easier to find a particular judgment let's scroll down and see if we can find pension here there we go pension this is Santam the, the all SA citation is given as well as the South African law report citation and according to the note this note are up the decision was confirmed in this 2005 decision and a later 2009 decision so again same steward case so it brings you to the same case different citation but same case the message still the same read the steward judgment together with the original pension case to know to what extent the pension case is still good authority